Here's adventure. Here's romance. Here's O. Henry's famous Robin Hood of the Old West, the Cisco Kid. Jim? Yeah, I'll bet you are. I've been three years in that stir coop, and you ain't ever showed up once. I didn't dare risk it, Jim. They might have tied me in with that robbery and sent me up here, too. Yeah, yeah, sure, I know. Where's my horse? Over there. Your gun, too. Jim. I didn't do anything honest. I'm still your friend. I'm not confiding you. <laughs> Stop squawking. I ain't gonna hurt you. Just want you to do a little timing for me. See the tree over there? The little one? Yeah. I'm gonna blast it three times before you can make your draw. When I count three. You ready? Yeah. One. Two. Three. <laughs> My thunder, Jim. You always were pretty good with a gun, but now why? You're chain lightning. How come? I had three long years to practice. Practice with what? With the dummy gun I made up on the quiet in the tool shop. For hours at a time, I did nothing but stand in my cell and draw and dry fire, draw and dry fire. Getting ready for those two coyotes that sent me to prison. You mean Bill Shannon and the Cisco kid? Yeah. Shannon's still in town, I hope. He is. We got business in town. Yep, all set, sis. Why the gun? You've never worn one before around the office. Expecting trouble? Me? <laughs> Shucks, no. I'm just getting so I don't feel quite dressed up without it. So that's why you're wearing your gun. You knew Brent was getting out of prison today. Now, don't get excited, sis. Please get in the back room and hide. Hurry, he'll kill you. I don't think so, Rita. My hide's pretty tough. But... You know why I'm here, Shannon? I promised I'd get you when I come out of prison. I'm here to keep that promise. Get out of here, Brent. Yeah. 
I'm first. Twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five. Hurry, Pancho. Cisco, all the time you are in a hurry. If I listen to you, I starve to death. Twenty-six. No, twenty-five. You are always eating, and I get nothing to eat. Come, Pancho. You know I have an appointment. An appointment. Stay low, West Gombe. All the time you are jumping from the pancake into the frying pan. Say, why you do all these things I don't understand? Now, Pancho, didn't we get word that Brent will be looking for us in San Lorenzo today? Eh? Uh, doesn't Brent want to shoot me? Eh? Well, then let's not keep the gentleman waiting. Hey, look, West Gumby, why do you want to get killed so quick when you can get killed later on just the same? my friend. Why so surprised, Brent? I didn't think you'd have the nerve to meet me. The Cisco kid always tries to oblige. Why don't you draw? Get out of this country and stay out. Next time, I'm not going to be so generous. Get going. Why don't you put that in your smoke and pipe it? Don't worry, Rita. You heard what the doctor said. Bill will be all right. In the meantime, Pancho and I will run the stagecoaches for you. Yeah, Bill will be up and around before you can say Robinson Jack. You know, he's a pretty tough hombre like I am. <laughs> <laughs> Just a flesh wound. Yeah, give me a hand with the bandage. I got some news, Jim. That ought to make you feel much better. Make us both rich. Yeah? There's going to be plenty of cash on the stage leaving San Lorenzo tomorrow. You know who's going to do the driving? Who? Cisco. Yeah? Yeah. I'm sorry I didn't get back sooner, Miss Rita. I'd have not only kept Bill from getting shot, but Cisco wouldn't be driving upstage. 
That's a bad mistake you made, trusting him with all that money. I trust him with everything we own, and so would Bill. Well, it's your money and will be your loss. You sound as though he's already stolen it. He will. You don't know his reputation like I do. And don't say that I didn't warn you. Cisco and his pal myself. You pick up the stage after I get him. Didn't I tell you to get that stage through? See, but the hunter was on the other. Don't stand there arguing with me. Get back to it. Go on. You dumb mule. Look what you did. Oh, Cisco. Ah, uh, your head is good for nothing but just to eat tortillas. Well, Cisco, I was afraid they were going to kill you, so I come back to help you. Didn't I did right? I guess you always mean well. What are you going to do now? Walk. I will, but I don't like it. Cisco, 
when I'm getting blisters on my feet, I think. And sit down and I'll pull you. <laughs> no, and get blisters some other place? <laughs> no, gracias. Well, why we are coming back here again? To get our horses, like I told you, and see if we can get back the money for Bill and his sister. Don't move, Cisco. Now, what's all this about, Sheriff? Trying to get your horses and sneak out, eh? Start moving both here. Sorry to say this to you, Rita, but we were attacked by outlaws. Yeah, they take the stagecoach, the money, and everything. Who are you trying to fool with that cock and bull story? I suppose you think we stole the money. I haven't got the slightest doubt, Cisco. Well, I have plenty of doubt. If they say they were held up, I believe them. You had the truth. Try and convince the judge when he gets around. Rita, you tell Bill... I'll lock that handcuff. Get your gun, Pancho. Now get our horses. what you like, Sheriff. But we'll be back, Rita. by the stagecoach. They will lead us to Brent. Oh, then you are using my brains, eh? Hey, what is this? Where did you get this watch, Pancho? Oh, somewhere else. You better take it back where you got it from. No, not where I got it. But it was only a joke. Uh The, the, the 
Fritz is here, but where is the stagecoach? You must have hid it. Keep out of sight. the front. I'll get around the back. your hands up and turn around. Remember you asked for this print. Still think, Cisco, you and Poncho ought to stay and help us run the stage line. Why don't you, Cisco? Eh, for Poncho and Cisco, it is the open road. Thank you. Yeah, and with the trouble and the share, with always breathing down your heels. <laughs> well, I'll have to be going. I have an appointment and I don't want to be late. I, uh... My watch and chain are gone. Someone may have stolen it, Sheriff. If anyone did that to me, I'd put him away for 40 years. Cisco, let's win pronto. But Pancho, you must say goodbye to the Sheriff. He has been very kind to us. Bueno. <laughs> Adios, amigo. <laughs> goodbye. Goodbye, Pancho. <laughs> goodbye. Goodbye, Cisco. Goodbye. Goodbye, Rita. Goodbye, Bill. We'll be back soon. Adios.